Class 4 lasers are dangerous. Safety first and therefore put on safety goggles when the laser is in use. The Sculptfun S30 Pro Max can be ordered through www.sculptfun.com. All manuals and firmware are available there, of course also technical support. A very good video for setup and installation is the video of Kokomio, and I link in the description. For technical information, software settings, and really good explanations you can visit Melvin Iskin's wiki. I can only recommend the website to everyone. Today we are not dealing with the frame, but the laser module of the Sculptfun 30 Max Pro. A diode laser with approximate 450 nanometers and 20 watts of optical power, for diodes with 6 watts each. The Sculptfun S30 Max Pro runs on 24 volts and 4 amps. And now I wish you a lot of fun with. Test, try, and try to find an optimal cut, smiley face. That I can change my 16 laser modules for testing quickly and easily, I use the Wham Bam Tool Changer on my Sane Smart Pro Ver XL4030 CNC machine. The advantage here for various laser modules is a height adjustable Z axis. By the way, I measure the power of my diode lasers with a Gentech Proto 250. And now I wish everyone a lot of fun with the following attempts how to cut optimally, the Sculptfun S30 Pro Max and many thanks to Neil from the Sculptfun team. You did everything right.